As the winter wraps us in its chilly embrace, it's a great time to catch up and cozy up on the latest trends in the Reno Tahoe area. Hi, welcome to your Northern Nevada market update. We're Amy and Billy Boylan with the Boylan team and we're your go-to experts for all things local real estate. Whether you're cozied up by the fire, dreaming of a new home, or consider selling in this winter market, we have all the insights and updates you need. And so let's dive into what's happening in this dynamic December community during this frosty season. Let's take a look at the numbers for Reno, Nevada for November 2023. Median sales price was $585,000. Closed sales was $214,000. Median days to contract was 31 days. Active inventory right now in Reno is 482 properties, and that's about two and a half months of inventory. Comparing the prices from November to October, the median sales price dropped just slightly to two and a half percent. And the median days to contract took a little longer. It's up at almost 15%. So homes are taking a little longer to go into contract. And the average inventory, months of inventory supply is staying steady. Let's take a look at the numbers for Sparks, Nevada for November, 2023. Median sales price is 530,000. 101 homes closed in November. The average days to contract was 39 days. Active inventory right now in Sparks is 221 homes and the month supply of inventory is 2.2 months. And if we compare October to November, the median sales price went up almost 2% and the median days to contract much slower at 34.5%. And then the average inventory dropped just slightly in Sparks. Let's take a look at the numbers for Carson City, Nevada for November 2023. Median sales price was 510,000. Closed sales was 41 properties. Median days to contract 32 days. Right now, active inventory in Carson City is 100 homes and the month supply of inventory is two and a half months. If we compare October to November numbers, the median sales price dropped slightly, almost 13% in November. And the median days to contract was just a hair slower, about 3% slower. And the month supply of inventory dropped slightly. Now let's take a look at Douglas County for November, 2023. Median sales price was 613,000. Closed sales was 34. Median days to contract was 39. Active inventory is 161 homes and almost five months worth of inventory. Compared to October, 2023, the median sales price is down slightly about two and a half percent. Homes are taking a little longer to go into contract, just a little longer. And the big number is the active inventory is up 42% from last month, which means a lot more homes for sale in Douglas County. Now let's take a look at Fernley for November, 2023. The median sales price was 378,000. Closed sales was 33. Median days to contract was 45. 76 active homes on the inventory and about two and a half months worth of inventory in Fernley. Compared to October, 2023, the sale, the median sales price is down roughly about 2.8%. The homes are going in the contract quicker and there's less homes for sale compared to October, 2023. Now let's take a look at Lyon Story in Churchill counties. The median sales price was $386,000, 81 closed sales, 41 days to contract, 248 active homes available for sale and roughly a little bit over three months worth of inventory and Lyon Story in Churchill County. Compared to October, 2023, the median sales price is roughly down about 3.3%. Homes are taking a little bit longer, just a slightly longer to go into contract and the active inventory is down just a hair. So now let's take a look at a snapshot from November, 2023 to November, 2022. This is the number everybody likes to see. The median sales price is up almost 2% from last year. The median days the contract homes are moving a little bit quicker and the active inventory is way down. This right now, and it's a shifting market, ever shifting every day, but this is the sweet spot. There's buyers out there. Nationwide, there's 11 homes sold every minute. Homes are selling even with the record low inventory, even with the interest rates that were going north and now starting to go south a little bit. The inventory's out there, the buyers are there, and sellers, you have record equity over the last three years. So this is the sweet spot for the buyers to get in their home. If you want to refine three years down the line, that's there for you. And the sellers are given concessions. This is the time, the sweet spot, before the interest rates go down too low and the homes start going north even more. 
So this is exactly why you need a local expert to guide you through the market. You see how the median sales price is going up, but sellers are offering concessions, interest rates are fluctuating. You need people that have their finger on the pulse of the market and work with other professionals, lenders and such, to help you get the best deal and make you and help you understand what's happening so you can make the best decision for you and your family. Amy and I's passion is to give you all the information for you and your family to disseminate when the time comes for you to make the best decision. Thanks for watching. We look forward to seeing you next time. For all your local market updates, Northern Nevada news and events and lifestyle, check us out on all your, your favorite socials. On Facebook, The Boylan Team, Nevada Homes Now, Instagram Homes by The Boylan Team, TikTok, The Boylan Team, The NV Realtors, and YouTube, Living in Reno Sparks, Nevada. We're Amy and Billy Boylan with The Boylan Team and EXP Realty. We love what we do. And you will too.